There's something wrong with my little brother. Granted, he still acts like a kid and such, but he has rather dark thoughts. Let me explain. Our family hasn't always been the best. Our father is a single parent and our mother is a hard drug addict and she was abusive to us. I honestly believe that's the cause of my brother's problems. It's like a switch has gone off in him. His behavior is just so different. He began changing when I noticed him isolating himself a lot. I could always hear him as our rooms were sharing a wall. It would be so quiet when anyone would enter, but otherwise you could hear thumping, running, and all sorts of noises. Dad would oftentimes tell him to quiet down in there, and sometimes I'd have to go in there myself. One time, after I did this, I noticed he had drawn all over the place. The walls, the bed, and even his face. Not too alarming, until I noticed him hiding a piece of paper. When I asked him about it, he replied with, It's nothing. So I grabbed it, and it alarmed me. It was of me and my father. We were in our beds, and we had knives sticking out of our backs. I crumbled it up as it disgusted me, and he protested. I informed our father, who simply brushed it off. Things continued to escalate from here. When one night, I went to get a glass of water, and it was dark. As I walked through the hall to the kitchen, I thought I heard something as I passed by the dining room table. Right as I stepped into the kitchen, though, I screamed as a sharp pain was in my foot. I limped to turn on the light, when it was then that I noticed someone had placed glass on the floor. My father came down and helped me, as did my brother. I screamed at my father that I believed my brother placed the glass there out of retaliation. When my dad looked at him, he admitted it, but said he wanted a glass of water and accidentally knocked down one of the glasses. He then fled because he was scared he'd get into trouble for it. My dad believed this and scolded him for not saying anything. I was believing maybe I was being paranoid until I noticed the smug grin on his face as dad continued getting up the glass. This evil mastermind schemes were far from over as that prompted me to write this. So this morning, uh, my father recently bought us a pet cat. He was an orange cat and we named him Garfield, like the cartoon. Garfield was a friendly cat and I really liked him. My brother noticed Garfield only liked my father and me, however. Something inside him snapped. One day, while Dad was out at work, I was playing our PS3, when all of a sudden, I heard this gagging and coughing noise. I rushed into the living room to see Garfield on the ground with blood coming out of his mouth. I screamed and called our father. When he finally made it home, it was determined Garfield's treats had been poisoned, leaving only one culprit. When confronted, we saw several scratches on my brother's neck, arm, and above his right eye. Seems Garfield didn't die without a fight. My father demanded the truth, but my brother sat there, menacingly, glaring at us. Then in a cold, callous tone, he uttered, I killed him because I wanted to. My father then disciplined him fiercely which I enjoyed watching. However, the entire time my brother would stare or occasionally glance up at me angrily. Which brings us to today's events. I discovered a note on my mirror of a poorly drawn dead cat stating, you'll be together again soon, both of you, with a smiley face. I've informed my father, but you can't help but wonder how and why someone you love becomes like this. It's clear signs that he needs help, and he has some sort of mental illness. I shudder to think what he'll become if left unchecked. <laughs>